What's poppin' is Enzo McFly. It's your girl, your car keys, I am. She what it do, man. This your boy, EG. What's up, what's up? It's your girl, Angry here. It's your boy, Mikey Iso. What's up? It's your girl, Desiree Simone. And we Hit 22 Radio, man. Y'all know what's going down. The biggest blood in America. Hey, man, you already know who it is. DJ Me What's going on, man? It's comedian Jeff Shelley. What's good, words? Homie DJ Chosen. Say, man, it's Wapi Puerto Rico, man. Baby boy, baby girl. It's your girl, B. Simona, with Catch-22. What's up, Houston? It's your boy, Quay. I just wrapped a dope-ass interview with Catch-22. Yo, baddest little baby, Bronx, New York, Savannah, Hannah. I just had the best time, Catch-22 Radio. Y'all got to tune in. It was lit just now. You know, we was chopping it up and all that. I got some projects coming soon. Check me out. YouTube, Savannah, Hannah, dollar sign on the S. I have a EP dropping real soon. Uh, you know, check out my freestyles on Instagram at Malibu Hannah, yes, and they was lit here, so. You're, you're now rocking with the voice of the South. C Catch 22 radio show on 92kills.com. Hey. And we back. Hey, 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 hey. It's Big Catch 22 cream. Radio on 92kills.com. Um, we have a dope, dope interview coming up. We have the incomparable, mm -hmm. the creative. Mm hmm uh, hard rapping. Mm -hmm. Savannah Hannah in the building. Oh What's happening? Yeah, let's get it. I love that just now. Aww. You got to bring them on tour with really you nice or something guys. for them to introduce you, babe. Listen, all right. Baddest little baby, Bronx, New York, Savannah Hannah. I don't know if y'all ready for me, but y'all got to deal with me, so. We got to. <laughs> y'all definitely going to have to deal with me. I already told you. I'm alpha female. So you so with, with that being said, what is a alpha female? Because I heard you say female. it in, in a freestyle. Okay. Ooh, all right. You know what? I like this guy right here, man. <laughs> this guy, I really like him. I feel like an alpha female is a female who is very sure of herself, doesn't need no man, doesn't need nobody telling her what to do, um, very smart, dedicated, always pushing herself to be dope, could do anything that a man is doing because, you know, these men out here be thinking that they could just run... You sound like a single stuff. mother. Yeah, for sure. Uh -huh. What you saying? That's what a single mother sounds like. Uh, but I'm not a single mother. Oh. I don't have kids. So, okay, so you know. an alpha female can be all but that, but she don't have kids. But an alpha female can be a single mom. Shout okay. out to all the single mothers, as a matter of fact. Yo, hold it down, man. Bro, you are from Listen. New York, in and, in and out. You can hear it. Really? All in the accent, everything. What are you doing in Texas? Oh, why you said it like <laughs> that? Like, I, I need to go wanna, home. I'm not saying nothing's wrong. Okay. I'm just trying to figure out what is the reason why. Because normally when people try to break, they, they go to New York, they go to Atlanta, they go to mm. LA. You came to Texas. All right, so check this out. The reason I'm in Texas is because I am one of those people that believes that in order for you to blossom as a flower from the concrete, you need to get out of your comfort zone. Okay. So being from New York, competition is very, very tough. And New York is like one of the hardest markets, in my opinion, to please. Mm -hmm. So I had to branch out, you know, to um, Texas. I feel Texas is more into like jingles and vibing and just, y'all just more chill. You know what I'm saying? So it's like coming down here, bringing my hard, I guess, hard toughness or whatever you know, it's a little different, so I stand out. I tend to stand out more than what y'all used to listen to. I like how you clean that up, because when you said, like, it was a harder market, and then you came to Texas, like, it was an easier market, you know people's going to be on your neck. Yeah, y'all could be on my neck if y'all want, but listen, I'm in Texas. I love Texas, so, Let's go. you know? So, so when you decided to move to Texas, how did you feel, or how did you figure out I was going to move to Dallas? Did you just, like, Texas, here it is, boom, put your finger down and say, here, that's where I'm going? Well... My story is way more deeper than that, so. <laughs> so what happened? But um, actually, someone believed in me. No. My cousin, she manages me, Miss okay. Latoya Logan. Um, I love her to death. I wear all her wigs, so when y'all see them wigs, y'all already know Miss Latoya Logan collection. Um, she wanted to manage me. She's seen a lot of potential in me, and she's based in Dallas. Oh, so okay. on top of me needing to branch out, boom, my manager live in Dallas. Boom, now I'm here. Mm. You know, so that's really how I'm here now, and I'm settled down in Dallas. How long have you, you know? been out here? I've been out here for six months. Six months. How you like, like it? So I feel like a newborn baby. Uh, I'm really? trying to adjust, but it's like, you know, uh, um, I like it. I do like it a lot. Okay. It's a little slower, you know. Got to drive everywhere. I'm not the best driver in the world. I mean, so. did you have to drive in New York? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Subway. Yes, there's a subway on every corner. It's a bus on every corner. 
Thanks. So it's like, you know, and if you got a car, you be tight half of the time because you can't find parking. True. You know what I'm saying? But out here, yeah, it's really tough to find parking in New York. And out here, it's just like you have to drive everywhere. So I don't know what's worse, to be honest. It's like bittersweet. All right. So I can't drive. I seen seen your video of the Tatiana freestyle, right? That was hard. Right. Oh, I wasn't even talking about the rap. And the hardest oh, part was okay. she came out drinking a 40. Stop playing. Hey, y'all know how I feel about 40. She came out with like the brown paper bag. It was she icy opened cold. it up. You like but you don't know what was in that okay. bag, though. What, what kind of No, no, it was a gold cap. I seen it. Oh, okay. You were really What you attention. thought was in my bag? I mean, it could have been anything. It could have been a bud ice. It could have been a <laughs> No, no, it was a gold cap. It was, I it was OE. sure it was that. Aww. It was Schlitz. Okay. Okay, so when it when it came to I guess the the visual for you know because I've seen you do a lot of challenges like you've done the uh, the little baby and Yo Gotti challenge yeah. you've done the uh, I even seen you rap to the Twenty One Savage beat yes mm -hmm. uh, that was a hard one thank you so uh, like do you feel like that's essential for an artist to actually have to do in this day and age to to break um, I feel like uh, I'm big on paying homage so I'm big on like showing respect to people that like. Um, are basically popping like you know they have these dope instrumentals and i feel like instagram is everything right now right. social media is the gateway you know people need to hear that i'm versatile i can spit on any beat i can spit on what y'all want to hear is new i even got some freestyles that i was rapping on old school stuff like you know like little big pun instrumental you know i could do a little <laughs> something something i like to switch up so it's like i just want people to see how versatile i am you know mm. so so with with the with the with the freestyling and you saying that you are a hard female, do you do you kind of get frustrated with hearing like you rap like a dude? All right, so a hard female, like I was just about to address that because I'm from New York, I'm from the Bronx. Everybody assumes that it's like, you know, walking down the block and then up there. No, like I want to chill, I want to be cute, I don't want to be hard all the time. But I do like to but write extra my aggressive. lyrics. Verse, I am verse. a little... Mm, 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 you, you for sure, for sure. Yeah, especially <laughs> y'all bite your nickels. But still, yeah, still, you still, you still girly girl at Yes, home. I am a girly girl. No. Like, do you I, not hear this? What? I'm, there's no... You know no, what, guys? She, he's making me be aggressive, okay? Because... I'm making... No, 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 no. You can't really do off it with that. <laughs> That's that BX coming out. Oh, oh sure. now I'm getting... No, y'all, I'm getting a triple team right now. I'm snitching. <laughs> yeah. It's three of them right now and it's one of me. I'm just, I'm just the referee. <laughs> I gotta be the referee because trust me, you in the middle of two two heavyweights. Oh, okay, all right. But okay. you holding your own though. Y'all got it. Y'all got it. I want to smoke. I wanna so smoke. I did see you have you know a girly moment um, on the <laughs> feature. Uh, I can't remember who it was, Malcolm but uh, King. F it up. Okay, yes. Oh, yeah, that song. Y'all you know, like the song? Have you heard it? Yeah, I've heard well, I heard your part because that's the only part you posted. Oh, yeah. okay. All right. Um, but I seen you have a girly moment. You know, you got out the car. Yes. And you was like, eh, I'm about to. So, like. Yes. How do you. So, how do you differentiate, like, your like your toughness and your softness with being a female MC? Okay. What I personally say is I have three styles. So, I always say that, like, I'm. Savannah Hannah is who I am. Like, that's me. When I'm writing, I talk about a lot of deep situations. I like to just go off. Like, okay. Malibu Hannah, which is my Instagram name, that's like the Barbie in me. Like, the real, if I want to talk about, you know, shaking my little booty or something, even though it's really little. Or, like, if I want to talk about being sexy, that's Malibu. Then I got Teflon. So, Teflon is that hard female that you're talking about. I'm, I do get very aggressive, depending on how I'm feeling. So, that's how I break down who I am, because I'm so versatile. Right. And I don't know how to put myself in a category and say I'm just a hard rapper. Because I could go pop, too. You know, like, I'm real... I'm different. I like to switch up, so... So how do you feel about the game now? Because it feels like they only let, let one female in at a time um, mm. and being so male-dominated. How do you feel about this? I mean, the game, I feel like it's just, I feel like it's super tough. You know, you have to have tough skin. I'm happy I have, like, a good support system. I have a great team that, like, keeps me stable because I've already been through some stuff. And I'm up and coming underground, you know, like, on the rise. But it's like, I feel like it is very tough. Women you know, don't really get the respect that I feel they deserve. And they have to go about being great by doing these real scandalous things that I just am not doing, you know? So it's yeah. like, oh my gosh, how can I stand out without having to do these things that women have to do to be even recognized? Twerk. You, you know? No, I have a small twerk. butt, so twerking is little like, if you want right. to see a little hey, booty twerking. Let's what? not do that. Little, little booties matter. matter. 
Oh, I love y'all for real. Yo, yo, y'all better listen, man. This is the place to be. I'm happy I'm here right now, man. Little booties matter. Wow. Okay, all right. That just made me feel real good. All right. But yeah, so it's tough. It is hard. But I mean, hey. Let's see what God's plan is. This is just what I do. It's what I love to do. So any female rappers you listen to or inspired by growing up? Yeah, uh, growing up. I love Missy Elliott. Um, I love... Um, I listen to a lot of male rap. I'm sorry. Like, I don't mean to... Okay, go ahead. Um, I used to listen to, like, Dipset, like, uh, Styles P. Uh, you New York, big, New York. Yeah, that, I know. I nobody know. from the South? I like T.I. Like, I love T.I. My dog. That's like my favorite. Yeah, yeah. Right. Oh, Mike Jones. He's hard. Like, uh, oh. Mike Jones. <laughs> <laughs> Mike Jones. No. No? no. So when you think oh, okay. of Houston, that's what you think of? Yep. Houston. Yep. <laughs> when I think of Houston. Let's not do this. Come yeah. on with it. I want to hear it. Come on. I, look, I, guys, I'm I really want to know. Why y'all doing this to me? No, no, no. no, no we really want to know. This is the because... H Town. I give y'all respect. I'm learning. Right. No, she, no, no, no. She already because... gave y'all Houston artists. This because... was the first one off our lips, y'all. I'm saying because we we are grounded here. So we, Facts. For what, what we see as like somebody that's popping or somebody that we know to somebody else is completely different. Like... I, I like that. Oh, yeah. I love Sauce Walker. Sauce, Sauce yeah. I'm saying yeah, that right? Yeah, no, yeah. Oh, I love him. Yo, he's so hard. Oh, my gosh. You I like love his Sauce music Walker. or you like his social media presence? I love his presence. music, his attitude, his demeanor. He's just See? like... I well, talk. Well, mm, mm, not mad. I can't really yeah. go and film me, but you know yeah. how he be doing that. And he yeah. got this, ooh, yeah, that energy is like... <laughs> oh, I love him. I think y'all two on the record would be dope. Oh, yeah, that would be Lord, fine. please. That would be fine. Listen, man, make that call. I yeah. come through with that same energy, like... Yeah. I think y'all two on the record would, would be awesome. make that call. We're going to see. We're going to make some something. We're going to make something man, shake. be ready for me, man. I'm coming and I... <laughs> so are you working on any upcoming projects? Um, Yes, I'm working on an EP right now. You know, um, some videos to drop. You know, so people could keep seeing me, but definitely an EP, and I'm gonna call it three. So it's gonna have a Why three? combination of all three of my personalities. Three different people. Because I'm a psychopath, so I got. Okay. Oh, that's why you're single. Uh huh. <laughs> that's got definitely it. why you're single. Oh, you want to go there? Oh, y'all just assume I'm single. No, you want to go there? Oh, y'all. Just I thought assume. you said. I thought you said it. No, no, I no, said no. Shout no, out she... to the single mom. Oh, she said she was, she said she was single. Oh, no, 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 no. Look, let's clear it up. Are you single? Uh, Listen, I'm I'm gonna drop a single real soon. Oh, <laughs> she don't want to uh-huh. say she got a band. So she got situations. No, 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 no. She got somebody that she's supposed to claim. But she just don't want to claim him in person. Oh, and he's just making assumptions. You have a cancer for real. <laughs> That's just what it is. <laughs> hey, look at you. Because you could have said, "Yeah, I got a man," but you was like, "I got a single coming out." That means I thought that's what I was here for. Am I getting interviewed for? You get interviewed to be so we get to know you all around, music and everything else. <laughs> I like the jacket. Oh, Oh, thank you. Like the Did he buy it? (laughs) (laughs) Yo, get this thing. Yo, get him. Get him. Why can't I just be just, you know, getting my own clothes? See? That's the problem right there. What? What's the problem? Women, we, we, you know, if I want to look cute, it's... Well, I got to be, oh, I'm looking cute, or somebody bought me something. Nobody be buying me stuff. So he didn't buy the jacket? You definitely should get somebody to buy you something. Yeah, for sure. I'm just saying... All right, so Miss Savannah Hannah, can you tell everybody where to find you on social media, please? Okay, y'all can find me at Malibu Hannah on Instagram. Y'all know the vibe. Savannah Hannah on YouTube with a dollar sign always is the S. Oh, no, we're not letting her go like this. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Oh, what? No, she promised us some bars, bro. She Aww. did. She promised us some bars. Okay, right. so can we get a quick instrumental? Uh, you got to give us like a quick like eight. 12. You know what I'm saying? 12. Up? Listen, I'm about to go off the top of my bean. So, y'all about to get it whatever comes out my mind and my mouth as long as it's not too. Uh, keep it PG 13. This PG-13. is a family show. Yeah. Okay. For sure. My, my grandmother listens to this show when she's not praying. And she can be like, that girl some bad. Cash 22 radio. You looking for the instrumental now, plus? Uh, so, DJ Nice Things going to get you an instrumental in a minute. Oh, Are you ready? One. All right, let's see what we got, man. Yo, y'all got a whole instrumental. My armpits are sweating right now. Oh, my God. Oh, no, it's hot in here. It is hot. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, you got us from New York? Huh? Hey. Who is this? A day went out, my baby. All right, where I'm going right now? Yo, 
chillin' in the radio, everybody know Savannah, Hannah, Hannah, Hannah got the killer flow Everybody wanna get next to me though They already know that I'm about the dough I'm going off the top, then I'm heading out the dough Everybody know, everybody know Catch 22 is the best radio And I got the killer, killer flow I'm from the Bronx and I just be chillin' I got the grills and I be go grillin' Everybody know I get high like the ceiling I'm joking, I'm getting high off of life You already know that I'm gonna do it right Everybody know that when I come, I'm a fight ah, I'm so aggressive, I'm so aggressive Take your best in, I'll leave you chestless I'll leave you breathless when you see me Cause I look good and I taste like candy <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I just said, but you know Rockin' with it, we rockin' with Listen, it Listen man, y'all dope, man Thank you. You're a dope as well. Mm-hmm. So we're gonna go into another little mix. You know what I mean with uh DJ A plus. And when we come back, we have another dope interview for y'all. It's Catch Twenty Two Radio. Make sure y'all stay tuned in. Hey. Let's get. You're, you're now rocking with the voice of the South. Catch Twenty Two Radio Show on ninety two kills dot com. You can get the biggest Chanel back in the store if you want it. I gave them the drill. They set it up. I got them on it.